Which of the structures given is the correct Lewis structure for the nitrite ion? NO2 with a negative one charge. We know that nitrogen and oxygen as second row elements will follow the octet rule. So let's see if all the atoms in these structures obey the octet rule. We'll start with structure A. The oxygen in, the, in structure A both have two bonds, giving four electrons, and two lone pairs, giving another four electrons, for a total of eight electrons. So the oxygens obey the octet rule. The nitrogen has four bonds, giving eight electrons, and one lone pair, giving two more electrons, for a total of ten electrons. The nitrogen violates the octet rule, so structure A is not a valid Lewis structure. What about B? Here we again have a double bonded oxygen with two lone pairs. We already determined above that this follows the octet rule. What about the other oxygen? It has one bond giving two electrons and three lone pairs giving six electrons for a total of eight electrons. So this oxygen follows the octet rule. What about the nitrogen? Nitrogen has three bonds giving six electrons and one lone pair giving two for a total of eight electrons. The nitrogen obeys the octet rule as well as both oxygens. So this is a valid Lewis structure. What about structure C? As in B, we have oxygens with one bond and three lone pairs. These follow the octet rule. The nitrogen in this structure has two bonds giving four electrons and one lone pair giving two electrons for a total of six. The nitrogen here violates the octet rule, so C is not a valid Lewis structure. What about D? We have an oxygen with two bonds and two lone pairs, which we saw on the previous slide does follow the octet rule. The second oxygen has three bonds giving six electrons and two lone pairs giving four electrons for a total of 10 electrons. The nitrogen has five bonds giving 10 electrons and zero lone pairs giving 10 electrons total. Both the oxygen and the nitrogen violate the octet rule, so structure D is not a valid Lewis structure. The only structure in which all the atoms followed the octet rule was B, so B is the correct answer.